What's good, Eagles fans? Y'all are tuned into another episode of Chalk It Up, where no matter if we win or if we lose, we just got to charge it to the game. I'm your humble host, Tony DeShields II, and on this episode, we got to talk about Alshon Jeffrey, man. We got to address the elephant in the room. Alshon Jeffrey has not been what he's been needed to be for this Philadelphia Eagles uh, team. Alshon Jeffrey has missed essentially a year and a half of football. He didn't play at all last year. And when he tried, ineffective. This year, hasn't played at all. And I'm essentially at my wit's end with Alshon Jeffrey. I'm going to preface everything with this. Alshon Jeffrey has been a significant part of this organization. Alshon Jeffrey has done things for this organization that we'll forever be grateful for. In 2017, we won our first Super Bowl. And Alshon Jeffrey was so key to that, it, it, it can't even be, it, it can't be understated. He's been so productive and reliable and reliable, excuse me. <clears throat> He's been so productive and, re and reliable. It really pains me that this is how this relationship is going to end. I'm not going to just act like Alshon Jeffrey didn't ball out for us for the time he was here. That 2017 year, he did his thing. Played the entire season on a torn rotator cuff. The entire season. Catching deep balls like crazy. Just possession catch after possession catch. Being, just being there when he needs to be there. Him and Wentz was balling. Him and Foles was balling. You know what I'm saying? So when you think about it like that, Alshon Jeffrey is such a key person in Eagle history. But we have to move on. It's time to move on. Alshon Jeffrey doesn't have it anymore. He's injury prone at this point. He's dealing with a Liz Frank injury that he's supposed to be coming back from, but now he apparently has another injury with his calf. He he tweaked his calf or something. And then prior to that, he was ill. He has so much going on and he's in his 30s. He's never been quite fast. Um... So just how dynamic can he really be for us in the future? Let's be honest. The, do, does he still have it? I think not. And it's time for us to move on and go with our young guy, Travis Fulham. He's a similar build, similar type of uh, athlete, but I think he's quicker on his feet. You know what I'm saying? That's what I think. At this point, we got to move on and go with our young guys. We have to. Alshon Jeffrey, another injury. On top of the list, Frank, like at this point, whoa, the season's damn near halfway over. And Alshon Jeffrey, where have you been for us just for covering? Your contract has just been a nuisance on the cap space. Just been a nuisance. And the Eagles need to find a way to cut their ties with that relationship. It's been beautiful. It's been it's been amazing. It's been spectacular. It's been storybook. It's been electric. But Alshon Jeffrey, it's time for us to move on from you, my brother. It's just that simple. Y'all was tuned into another episode of Chalk It Up, where no matter if we win or if we lose, we just got to charge it to the game. I'm your humble host, Tone DeShields II. One love, y'all. Fly, Eagles, fly.